snake competition uh, and now I'm forced to, to jump in the water, but horrible. Okay, <laughs> three, two, one, let's go! <laughs> There you go, how's that? Got a great video for you today on how to have fun outdoors. That's right, Branson, Missouri, and boy, is this a great place to visit. Tons of shows, country music, amusement parks, you name it. But best of all, that's right, Table Rock Reservoir. And this is one huge reservoir. It was built by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers back in 1954 to 1958 on the White River and uh, lots of great bass and walleye fishing. Today we're gonna show you some of that with our favorite charter in the area, and you're gonna love this video. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, give Aliche a big old like, and also leave some comments down below, send to your friends, anybody that loves the fishing, definitely uh, you're gonna be wanting to watch all of these great how to have fun outdoor YouTube videos on fishing with Aliche and Tommy T. So here you go from Branson, Missouri. Here we are at Table Rock Lake, right outside of Branson, Missouri. We couldn't get enough fishing from Captain Ricky, so we found another Rick. That's and right. uh, so, Rick, tell us, tell us about, uh, tell us about your charter, the name of your charter, the sure. lake we're on, and all the good stuff. Well, first of all, we're on Table Rock Lake, one of the most beautiful lakes in the country. And my name is Captain Rick. Also, I'm Big Rick. He's Little Ricky. So, <laughs> I like that. All right. We got to make sure we get that out of the way. Get that right. <laughs> That's right. That's right. We work together. We're good friends. And uh, uh, my company name is Chauffeur Guide Service. I actually have my son works with me, too. And uh, I've been doing this 25 years. 25 wow. years. Yeah, see how gray that beard is. Wow. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> 25 years. So tell us about the lake a little bit. We fish the river. And we were super impressed. I mean, right. lots of trout, uh, just amazing. But this lake we hear good things about too. So tell us a little bit about the lake. Oh, you bet. Uh, Tiburock Lake is a uh, 43,000 acre highland impoundment. Wow. So it, it has 950 miles of shoreline. So it's a huge lake. Uh, we're just going to be fishing a small part of the lake mm -hmm. and hopefully catching some bass and maybe some big walleyes. Now, with all those years of experience on this lake, there's no excuses, right, Aliche? Oh, yeah. The fish must be your friends. <laughs> they are my friends. Okay. That's why you have to kiss them every time you catch them. Now, yeah. did you grow up in this area? I grew up in northern and Wisconsin. Oh, no kidding. Yep. Okay. Grew up in Wisconsin, moved down here, 
in 1989 and uh, because I wanted to fish for a living. Now, are you still a Packers fan? Or are Absolutely. You, you are? Fan. Okay. All right. Uh, Look at that. <laughs> All right, so today what we got, uh, we got, it looks like a 2360 Ranger here. What do right. we got? 2360 Ranger powered by a 225 Yamaha. Wow. Yamaha, the most reliable motors in the market. And uh, this is a bay boat, very unusual for Table Rock, but it makes a great guide boat. Yeah. Very comfortable to fish on. Very, very nice. You got the Minn Kota up there. Minn Kota you got trolling motors and the Hummerbird graphs. They got three Hummerbird graphs. Got three on here. See, so you tied us. <laughs> no, that looks awesome. And then uh, we got the spinning reels. Uh, what are we going to be using today? We're Typical gonna fishing, bait. We're going to be fishing drop shots with night crawlers. Night crawlers catches a lot more fish than artificials. Right okay. Now. All right. You heard heard it so you did a little drop shot yeah. down in florida so you should know oh, this rig exactly. okay. yeah, yeah 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 the only thing is you use the little minnows when you were down there so yep. all right well let's do it uh we're early early here 6 a.m we got out early so we could catch the big one so right. let's go do it Captain Rick slowed us down here. Boy, you got that's like a television right there. What's yeah. that? A twenty-seven inch? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's HBO Sports, ESPN. There you go. Uh, looking for fish on this point right now. We pulling up on this. You can see I've been fishing here according to the GPS. Yeah. And uh, I'll let you know when I see some. I see some small fish, but that's all I How see. How many right inches now. on that hummingbird there? Seriously, that's, that's a big. Screen. That's the twelve inch. That is the yep. twelve. Wow, it looks even bigger than twelve. That yeah. thing is amazing. So Helix twelve, great unit. I love them, especially when you pair the four different views. You can see the side imaging, the down imaging, the two yeah. D graph, and then the GPS. You got it all. To be able to tell. Wow, yeah. Right where you're at. Look at that, huh? And if there's fish there. Now my dad, my dad wouldn't allow all that. He'd be like, "That's cheating." <laughs> yep. yeah. it is cheating. My dad used to take a, a window weight on a big rope. That's how we figured out how deep it was. Did he? Really? <laughs> That's awesome. It's beautiful out here, huh, Alicia? Yes, it is. Got your there. little sunrise. Look at that. Boy, Alicia, you're getting good at this with your live scope back home. You've got this. Well, uh, I have to be ready to get dinner for tonight. Look at so that, folks. We got some team. action down there. Yep. Let's see what we can do. Let him bite it. Let him go down. Let him go down. And then jerk him and reel. Really? Yep. I let him go. Okay. Yep. Let him go. Let him eat it. Okay. He grabs that worm. And let him eat it. Let them have that breakfast. Yeah, it's breakfast time, fishies. <laughs> All right, Captain Rick is ready to go here. He's keeping the worms warm. Take a mm -hmm. look at that, folks. <laughs> And we're getting this uh, drop shot all set up. So show us what you got here. You got the sinker on the bottom. Hook above it about a foot. Yeah. And I got a swivel up there that keeps it from there. And then that warm worm, you put it just once on the hook. Just once on the hook. And then the little swivel up there. And you're Drop good to go. Straight down. And you've got us on the spot lock with the Minn Kota, correct? Yes. And that works out pretty well for you? Oh, uh, excellent. Great technology, huh? Yes, unbelievable technology on that Minn Kota. Yeah. Ooh, we got to let him bite it. We got to let him bite it. <laughs> One more. Thank you, Captain. Nice, 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 nice. They are ready for breakfast. Holy cow. Wow, this is a big one. At least for me. Wow, look at this. Aliche right out of the gate. Look at the nice bass, huh? Wow, is this a bass? A beautiful. A wow, bass. look at that. Bass, look at this. this what do you a, got? This is a spotted bass. Or yeah, you see? It's different. Yeah, it's a different bass. Spotted bass. bass. Look at that, huh? That what a beautiful fish. Hold him up there, Alicia. Get your picture. Okay, you got him. Oh, wait. Yes. 
All right, Alice, well done right out of the gate. Yeah, you've uh, 605 in the morning, <laughs> took me five minutes. All right, well done. The first fish of the day. <laughs> <laughs> now Alice's all pumped up. She's, <laughs> she's, see, she he, was. He bites it. He bites it. You, yeah. You go. You let him have it. You let him have it, and then boom. Yeah. Yeah. You feel it really well. Ah, yeah. nice. Yeah. So tell everybody what day it is today. Today is July Fourth, Independence Day. And tell everybody what tomorrow is. Tomorrow is the best day of the year. It's the July Fifth. That is our anniversary. That's our anniversary. So, yeah. two years married, but uh, big Captain Rick here. How many years married? 44. 44. My mom and dad's 57 years. Oh, my God. And your parents? How? Uh, almost 37. Yeah, almost 37. So, that's good. So, Captain Rick, these are any special worms here? Any Absolutely. Secret, any they secret are, to those? They are farm-raised Canadian night crawlers. Are they farm-raised yes. Canadians? All right. Well, yeah. We feed, yeah. The, we feed the fish of good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> we feed them good stuff. Right, Captain? When you put them on the hook, they go, eh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> eh, eh. All right. One crank. There you okay. go. One crank. So, Captain Rick, what's the biggest uh, bass you caught out here? Uh, the biggest bass uh, a customer has caught out here is eight and a half pounds. It was in the spring. Okay. And uh, the biggest bass I've ever caught was nine and a half pounds. That was uh, in the middle of the summer. No kidding. Okay. And uh, caught it on a jig and spoon. Uh, it was just a really good day that day. and and Nailed it. That's back when I used to be able to fish. I don't get to fish anymore. So. <laughs> Well, with yeah. us, you can join us. You can grab a pole, right, Alicia? You oh, have no yeah. problem. <laughs> no, we take care of you. Oh, huh? <laughs> All right. They go bop, 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 bop. I do actually uh, charters up in northern Wisconsin. Okay. And uh, I'm up there for, along with little Ricky. He's up there, too. Uh, we go up there for seven weeks. And my wife comes up for a week, and we fish together for a week. It's kind of our little oh, vacation. We've that's been doing awesome. that for 36 years. Now, what do you usually catch up there? Uh, we fish, uh, we guide for trophy smallmouth. We get smallmouth up to eight pounds up there. Wow. Yeah, yeah, what time nice. of the year you go there? We might have to join you for a <laughs> charter up there. Yeah, we uh, go up there. We're up there starting August 20th, and we're up there until uh, the first week of October. Okay. Wow, nice. What do we got here, Captain? That's uh, our uh, hummingbird graphs on the side image will actually show you the the fish. I mean, yeah. that's a that's a paddlefish swimming by the. Boat. That's the paddlefish right yes. there. That's one of those prehistoric looking yes. things. Yes, yes, absolutely. Wow! You catch them out on this lake too, huh? Yes, we do. We uh, we have a season for them. The season starts uh, March fifteenth until April thirtieth. Okay. And you have to snag them because that's, they eat plankton. You can't put a plankton on a hook. So um, that's what we do. And uh, we're real successful. We, My son and I, we uh, snagged 226 paddlefish this year. Wow. Now and the largest the... was 94 pounds. 94 yep. pounds? I... Wow. Yes. <laughs> He's almost like me. That's almost like you. <laughs> we did catch one the year before that was 110. 110? Yes. Wow. And the 94 pounder was caught by a, a, a woman that was about five foot two. No kidding. <laughs> yes. Wow. There you go. So that runs from March till when? March 15th to April 30th. It's a 45 day season. Okay. And uh, we're busy doing that every day. Wow. Look at that, huh? Yeah, look like, at that, folks. It seems a big one. Huh? <laughs> this could be... Whoa, look at there. <laughs> Doing a little jumping around. <laughs> there we go. Hey, look at there, guys. <laughs> awesome. Right. Nice. Uh, are you sure it's a girl? This is a girl, Julie. Oh, Julie. So nice to meet you, Julie. Now, 
on this lake, so you got the bass, right? So, but what else you got in here? You got the walleye we heard? Yeah, we have walleye in here, which we should hopefully catch one today. Okay, um, good. We have crappie in here. We don't usually catch those or don't focus on those in, only yeah. in the spring. Uh, we have giant bluegills, you know. Just, Do you really? Just hand-sized bluegills. Um, and there's all the other types of fish in here. Do you have any pike in here at all? No, no, no pike, pike or no muskies. Um, That's smart. But uh, yeah. other than that, we do very well in all our other fish here. So. Okay. Catch some good size walleye or? Yeah, uh, we've had a couple over five pounds this last week. So No kidding. So we'll hope we get one today. Wow. All right. Ready to reel up? Reel up. A little more. A little more. A little more. A little more. That was a... Paddlefish. Jerk hard, jerk hard, jerk. Oh, yeah. There you go. Look at that. Real, 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 real fast. Oh, see, they swim straight up and then they get off. So you got to reel fast. Okay. <laughs> Born on March 11th. He's March 11th? Yeah. So, t t so Alicia and I have this theory about uh, the most awesome people in the world are Pisces. So tell them what you are, Alicia. March 1st. March 1st, the Pisces. I'm St. Patrick's Day, Pisces. You're and the cap. March 5th. March 5th is the captain, and your yes. son is. March 11th. March 11th. Four Pisces there. Yeah. We got Greg back home, our COO. His is March 17th, also. So yeah. we like our Pisces. We, we knew we liked Captain Rick, huh? Yes, the big Rick. The <laughs> big awesome. Rick, and little, little Rick, and that's why we call him Little Rick. Beautiful out here, huh? Yep. So now I have a question for the captain. What are the three most amazing locations where you like to fish? Northern Wisconsin is my number one location. I love to fish there. It's like fishing in Canada. Awesome. And but not in Canada. Yeah. Uh, we have a lot of lakes we fish up there. Probably, I maybe don't view it as a beautiful lake now because I work here every day but Table Rock Lake is my number two. Okay. Table Rock Lake definitely is my number two. And my number three lake is probably, a, there's a little lake north of Springfield called Stockton Lake. It's Stockton. a very, okay. very nice. It's a smaller lake. Mm -hmm. and gorgeous. I fish there in the winter a lot. So. Okay. All right. What do you usually catch there? Uh, we catch a lot of crappie on that lake. And All they right. got more walleye on that lake than they have on this lake. No kidding. Uh, so okay. it's, it's, a, it's a very good lake to fish. All right. All right. Perfect. So next time, Wisconsin. There you go. Sounds good. Yes, Wisconsin. I say it correctly. All right. Look at there. I got to get fish. You got a fish and you tangled up. That's good. I probably the only fisher woman that can do that. <laughs> All right. Nice walleye, Alice. Well done. Yeah. And the All right. Let him go. All right. <laughs> That's awesome. How do you like fishing on July 4th, huh? Uh, 
I feel he's awesome. Ready for the day to celebrate with fishes. Pretty awesome. All right, Alicia, we're gonna do the Italian word of the day. So, how do you say fish in Italian? Pesce. Pesce? Pesce. 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 Yeah? Pesce? Yeah, pesce if it's one. How about if it's more than one? Uh, uh, okay, what is it? Pesces? Pesci. 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 Pesci and Pesci. Pesci, girlfish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, for us, a fish is just a male. Just <laughs> a male? Yeah. Okay. He's a male. All right. Sure. Boom. Oh, you missed him. When, oh, you, did I miss when you jerk? Yeah. You oh, you hot dog, Alice. Oh, another walleye. You hot dog. Yes. What? Another walleye. Look at you. I'm a walleye girl. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, let him out. Let him go. All right, thank you. <laughs> I did my best. <laughs> Look at that guy. Oh, he Off away. he goes. <laughs> all right, Luce. <laughs> go. go, go. Oh, look at you, fish on. You got, you got it. Yeah, real, real. I'm keeping, I'm keeping, I'm keeping. Wow, nice, Alice. Wow, Alice. Hi, it's my walleye day. You're on fire. Look at that. <laughs> nice. Another walleye. Putting on, you're putting on a walleye clinic out here. What's going on? Well, I love a walleye. <laughs> Look at that, nice fish. Yeah, we can just show it like this. I don't have to take it like this. <laughs> you don't want to wrestle? You don't want to have <laughs> you don't want to have a round two wrestling with the walleye? No, I think I'm good with one uh, <laughs> wrestling day. Yeah. yeah, there you go. He's a fish, he's a female. Yeah. Yes. Female. He's a female. Yeah. <laughs> you see is why I didn't kiss him. There you go. <laughs> he's a female. Leche, you hot dog. Look at that pole, Ben. All right, look at this. Smallmouth. Smallmouth. Smallmouth this time. No walleyes. <laughs> you hot dog. <laughs> I like <rock it>, baby. <laughs> look at that. July 4th. Oh, it's <laughs> seven and seven, seven in a row. That's right. You know how this story ends every time. I'm gonna end up catching the biggest one. <laughs> seven to zero.
The meat is on the table. Come on, baby. Rail it we're in. For, we're going for the big daddy win. Yeah, like always. Nice bass. Look at this. Leche may catch more, but who catches the biggest? Always. Yeah. Look at this. Wow. Oh. That's a really good one, Tommy. That's a nice one. Fish, huh? Nice one. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. All right. I, was, I was behind it, Tommy. Were you? Yeah, it was nice. <laughs> no, it will, it will show like that this. one. Nice. Well done. <laughs> oh, oh, wow, that was a nice jump. Look at that. Whoa, little bass. Nice. Oh, we got a double. We got a double. We got a double. How long, Aliche? How long? We got a get, double. Get him. Get him. Mm, there he is. Look at that, folks. Boom. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We got a double. Oh, yeah. There we go. Look at that. Hold him up, Aliche. Right there. <laughs> awesome. Nice. Little bass. I was trying to do the captain job for one time. Wow, look at that. Oh, that's a nice bass. Nice bass. Wow. Good Is it a walleye? Mm -hmm. Wow, it's a walleye. Look at that. That's a really big one. All right. Let's see how many inches. What do you think, Captain? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. 18? Come on, let's do 20. <laughs> Liche, you're always wanting longer ones. Look at that. <laughs> you don't know how it is. Look at that. Never long enough for a Liche. What the heck? <laughs> like a, we call that a rock bass. Yeah, we call that a rock bass. Gagalai down here. Nice. Yeah. You got the gagalai. You got a walleye, bass, and a gagalai. Get your picture with that. That's a nice, pretty one. So you just stick it like this? No, hold your hand. Yep, like that, because they'll spine you. Look at that. Nice big old bluegill, huh? Wow. Mm, there we go. Look at that. Give right there. The there you go. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay, let's go. There we go, folks. That is Tommy T. Yes, baby, yes. What do we got? We got something different here. Something different. This lake is walleye. filled with a nice walleye. Look at that. Nice. Oh, this is. There we go. Nice walleye, huh? Whoa. Whoa. The drag is moving. Nice. Liche, you're jumping in if I catch the biggest one. Okay. No problem. Oh, this is a, oh, oh, we got a big one. We got a big one. Yes, so look at how big it is. Oh, yeah. Look at how big it is. Look at this. Look 
Very nice. nice. Well there. done. Yeah. Well done. That's going to be it for the day again, Alice. You caught like 10 times more. But once again, in the end, the big one. Show us. Show us, Tommy team. Nice. Very nice. Very All right, nice. All right, Alice. The new biggest fish, 20 inch walleye. You got to beat that or you're jumping in the water. That was the deal. All right, the competition accepted. <laughs> ready to give up, are you, Alice? Whoa, look at that. Nice one. Nice one. Yeah, I think it's a little short. <laughs> well, that one's a little short, Alice. 17 and a half. That bitch makes a difference? Oh yeah. like Leche is conceding. We only got about an hour left. Yeah. Huh? You have to you're gonna, arrive. You're gonna the jump in or what? When the captain saved it this time. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It got hot fast, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, look at that. Look at this. At least they keep that pole high. on last hour five jumps five on this one five jumps wow look at how nice he looks look this, one, folks. this one looks really nice <coughs> well done tommy t hello tommy that's good all right look at that beautiful fish huh yep Real oh, nice. I have a fish. All right, let's put this one back in. Boom, look at that. Did you lose him? Yeah. You lost him? Yep. 
Oh, we almost had another double. Almost. Double bubble. Double bubble. I'm gonna keep it. So big Captain Rick, so when you were growing up, did you fish with your father and that? I or? did. You I did? did yeah. So what kind of fishing did your dad like? Uh, we like to go perch fishing up north. And walleye fishing. And walleye. Yep. That okay. Was our, that was the type of fishing he taught me how to do. Uh, and uh, then I started bass fishing, bass fishing tournaments. I loved the bass fish. And, you did that? Yep. Wow. Yep. You're like Johnny Morris. Look at that. Well, um, I don't have as much money as Johnny Morris, but, you know, I'm happy. <laughs> so <laughs> That's right. That's right. And that's all that matters. That's right. That's right. So what kind of rig did your dad used to use when he was uh, catching walleye back then? We used a lot of um, just straight line split shot. Yeah. Uh, and uh, About a foot down with the hook. Right, right. Yeah. And uh, we'd catch those fish uh, probably about seven, eight feet of water. So it was... Now, have you ever tried fishing them that way here with the split shot that set up like that or no? Yeah, you can do that. The problem with the split shot set up is that uh, the, the worm gets on the bottom yeah. and that's not where you want the worm. Okay. And then also if you fish it a lot, what happens is the split shot and the line tangle up a lot. Right. They twist because the worm spins and so if you got the split shot on there it'll just get all wrapped up and had the drop any, shot is just a way better way to fish. Now do you have any brothers or sisters or? I have uh, three sisters, love all three of my sisters, none of them ever fished. None of them fished. But uh, you know I got to fish with my dad a lot yeah. and uh, um, I told him one time oh when I was in my 20s I said I'm gonna quit my job and fish for a living. He said, you never can do that. You'll never make it. Never make it. <laughs> he said that. But yeah. before he passed away four years ago, he said, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. That's awesome. That, that is a great, good great film. story. That's awesome. See that, honey? Yeah. So maybe I need to change careers and start up a fishing charter. What do you think? Well, uh, it's going to be interesting. <laughs> <laughs> and the reason is that I think you can do really well in summertime in New Hampshire, but good luck of finding customer in wintertime. <laughs> All right. There are no charters for ice fishing. Right <laughs> That's it. We start an ice fishing charter. <laughs> that could be Walter. Look at that ball. Keep it up. Oh, he took it off again. Yeah. Wow, that could have been Walter right there. Oh, now it's really, really hot. I'm ready to jump in. <laughs> so you don't mind losing? <laughs> no, nope, I'm not minding losing. Even oh, yeah. though Walter right now is just right down here and I need to catch him. There you go. Yeah. yeah, so that was probably a big walleye, don't you think? Oh, yeah, definitely a big walleye. That was a they big walleye. They got teeth, and they, when they shake their heads, they'll cut that line. Yeah, wow. But i got to tell you a story. I had a customer out, and uh, we were throwing swim baits. Yeah. We were throwing swim baits to the shore, and I told them, I said, throw the swim bait out, let it sink to the bottom real, real slow. And they kept twitching it and wiggling it, and I said, no, 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 you got to do it, throw it, Let's show us how to do it. So... I threw out there, started reeling it slow, boom, I caught about a pound and a half bass, and I said, see, that's, you know, oh yeah, wow, and then there was about a five pounder following the fish, and I'm going, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it, and they go, whoa, and my five pounder ate my fish, wow. and I netted them both, and we landed them both. Wow. <laughs> that's awesome. That's pretty awesome. So that, you know. You just don't know. You yeah, work. so many great and fishing course, stories. I ended the whole story with, that's how you do it. <laughs> yeah, that actually, it actually reminds me, remember, Aliche, we did the uh, How to Catch Bass at Midday down in Orlando. Great charter down there, but it's a very similar thing. Had a big monster bass on, broke the line and uh, with the drop shot. But what was crazy is on the very next cast, we casted it out. Caught the same exact bass, still had the other hook in there with the sinker. Wow. So, you know, there there you go. So you never give up, even if you lose them. You go right back after them. Hey, this is not fair. She keeps getting new worms. What's going on, Captain? Hey, you got a 
Take care of it. He's spoiling you, putting a new worm on all the time for you. I see what's going on. I finally figured it out. Look at that. Fresh worms. Look at that. All right, the captain's going to give her one last chance to try to beat Tommy T with the light. We're going to the final spot. This is a hot spot right here. All right. Leche and I absolutely love fishing down in Branson, Missouri. The trout fishing was remarkable and so was the bass and walleye. We had a blast all day long on July 4th, 2021 and we owe a big thank you to Captain Rick. He was one of the best charters that we ever had. The Leche absolutely loved him and uh, we caught a ton of fish during the day. So. We're gonna be wrapping it up, and as you'll see, Aliche had to do the big dive and uh, got the fish cleaned up and had a lot of fun in Branson, Missouri. Alright, Aliche, today you caught spotted bass, smallmouth yeah. bass. Yeah. You caught uh, rock bass. Yeah. You got uh, a little. Yeah. 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 What are they? Goggle eyes. Goggle eyes. That's right. I'll never for you, figure you, that out. You would never. You would never. <laughs> <laughs> you caught a little bit of everything. Yep. And you definitely caught more fish. But. 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 But the problem is, what happened? She should have caught the big fish. <laughs> she missed. Walter. She I was... missed Walter. And my husband got the big fish. So once again, uh, uh, I lost over my husband. So what was the bet when we started this? Well, now I have to jump in. All right, so get ready to jump in. Well, I can tell you, I jumped in the water in Maine with 60 degrees water. This water doesn't make me scared at all. <laughs> all right. To my competition and now I'm forced to, to jump in the water. That's horrible. <laughs> right. Three, two, one, let's go! <laughs> there you go, how's that? Perfect. <laughs> to come up with some better uh, bet in the future. I think you yeah, like jumping in the water too much. <laughs> well, I wouldn't jump in the water even if I was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. We had a fantastic day with uh, Captain uh, Rick, and uh, I know I lost. I know I had to swim, but I'm really happy about it. I hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button and thanks for watching. How to have fun outdoors!
Hey, happy 4th of July, you guys. 